Metal stenosis, Wikipedia article audio. Urethral metal stenosis or urethral stricture is a narrowing of the opening of the urethra at the external meatus slash mietus slash, thus constricting the opening through which urine leaves the body from the urinary bladder. Causes, incidence, and risk factors. Causes Incidence of metal stenosis. Comparative risk. Symptoms. Signs and tests. Treatment. Prognosis. Prevention. In the newborn. After hypospadias repair. The protection provided by the foreskin for the glands penis and meatus has been recognized since 1915. In the absence of the foreskin the meatus is exposed to mechanical and chemical irritation from ammoniacal diaper that produces blister formation and ulceration of the urethral opening, which eventually gives rise to metal stenosis. Metal stenosis may also be caused by ischemia resulting from damage to the frenula artery during circumcision. Numerous studies over a long period of time clearly indicate that male circumcision contributes to the development of urethral stricture. Among circumcised males, reported incidence of metal stricture varies. Griffiths ETAL reported an incidence of 2.8%. Sorensen and Sorensen reported 0%. Cathcart ETAL reported an incidence of 0.55%. Yegani ETAL reported an incidence of 0.9%. Vanha reported an incidence of 7.29%. In Vanha's study, all cases of metal stenosis were among circumcised boys. Symphorush ETAL reported an incidence of 0.55%. According to Emedicine, the incidence of metal stenosis runs from 9 to 20%. Frisch and Simonson placed the incidence at 5 to 20% of circumcised boys. Frisch and Simonson carried out a very large scale study in Denmark which compared the incidence of metal stenosis in Muslim males with the incidence of metal stenosis in ethnic Danish males. The risk of metal stenosis in circumcised males was found to be as much 3.7 times higher than in the intact, non-circumcised males. In boys, history and physical exam is adequate to make the diagnosis. In girls, VCUG is usually diagnostic. Other tests may include. In females, metal stenosis can usually be treated in the physician's office using local anesthesia to numb the area and dilating the urethral opening with special instruments. In boys, it is treated by a second surgical procedure called metotomy in which the meatus is crushed with a straight mosquito hemostat and then divided with fine-tipped scissors. Recently, home dilatation has been shown to be a successful treatment for most boys. Most people can expect normal urination after treatment. Accor writing to Frisch and Simonson the foreskin is protective against urinary stricture disease. Frisch and Simonson call for a thorough reassessment of the burden of urethral troubles and other adverse outcomes after non-therapeutic circumcision of boys. CDETAL propose long-term follow-up of circumcision with ultrasonography to detect metal stenosis before permanent renal damage occurs. Meyer and Livn suggest that use of a broad-spectrum antibiotic after hypospadias repair will probably reduce metal stenosis, while Jayanthi recommends the use of a modified snodgrass hypospadias repair. Urine Analysis, Urine Culture, CBC, Basic Metabolic Panel, Renal and Bladder Ultrasound.